Hi, this is Anthony, and in this tutorial, I will show you how to use the SWF tab in Explandio 2.0 Pro. Essentially, the SWF tab allows you to control flash animation, that is, pause and play animation at certain points. Now, this is just a basic tutorial just to show you how this works, but just know that there is much more to it. Also, before I proceed, it's worth mentioning that 24 frames equals 1 second. And it's important to know this because in order to get the timing right, you're going to have to use that a little math. Okay, so I will show you a couple of examples. One with an animated um, figure, this one right here. As you can see, I've already added two slides. And um, this one is the animated slide. Okay, now before I get into that, let me just show you how to add a flash animation to your canvas. So first of all, obviously, you need to create a project, which I've already done. Then you need to click this uh, plus sign or add button. You will see these two options. Just click on create new scene. You will then see this blank canvas. And at the bottom, you will see this little button that says add animation slash slide. Click on that. And from these two options, click on this one right here that says add flash animation. Okay. Then choose the animation uh, or the animated file from your computer. Uh, click open. I've already added mine, so I'm not going to add uh, another one. So I'll just cancel off from here. But you'd click open. And then um, if you do not want it to sketch, just check this box and then click add. So I'm just going to cancel out because, like I said, I've already added one. All right. So once you've done that, you know, you will see the um, either the slide or the animated figure here. And then you basically close the canvas. Okay. So as you can see, like I said, I've added two, uh, two slides. And I'm going to show you these two examples. So as you can see, this um, this animated figure is you know it, it's um, it's basically a simple animation. You know the the guy raises his hands you know with two thumbs up. So what you can do with this SWF um, tab, as you can see, there are a whole bunch of settings here. What it allows you to do is um, currently, as you can see, it's showing play for 85 frames. Essentially. Um, 3.5 seconds is 85 frames and uh, what you basically do is let me just pull the calculator here uh, just to show you so essentially you take 85 frames and divide that by 24 because 24 frames equals one second and that gives you you know 3.5 seconds okay so that's how you get to 3.5 seconds and um, what it basically does is here, as you can see, there are a whole bunch of um, settings that you can change. Um, and then it basically allows you to pause, okay, pause at frame uh, X for X frames. So essentially, uh, it, you can go to a specific frame and say pause at frame for, you know, X number of frames. Okay, so let me just show you a, a quick example here. So currently, as you can see, this one plays for 3.5 seconds, and his hands are raised for just about one second, if, if you see. What if I want to just make his hands stay there for, you know, five seconds? So what I've done here is, I've already preset this. Once you check this box, what you need to do is use this plus or minus signs. Unfortunately, right now you cannot just enter, but hopefully in the, uh, the new versions that come out, uh, we'll be able to enter the figure here. But for now, you would have to use this plus and minus signs. So as you can see, I said, pause at frame 24. And as, as you know, 24 frames equals one second. So pause at the one second mark for 120 frames. 120 frames is five seconds. So watch this now. I'm going to play this one as you can see his hands are now stuck there for five seconds and then they're down and watch it without it as you can see it's down in one second I'll do that again okay as you can see it's up there it remains up there stuck for five seconds and then down so that's how the basic animation works so similarly for a an animated slide what you do is, as you can see, uh, this is a basic slide. Let me pause, stop that and play it again. Okay, I'm just going to stop this. this. As you can see, it just it just stays there for about not even two seconds, right? So I have now 
created a similar kind of thing here for this slide. I said pause, you know, at um, one second. That's 24 frames. Pause it for five seconds. So just watch what happens now. As you can see, it stopped there now for five seconds and then it continues. Now watch what happens when I remove that. As you can see, it's much faster now. All right, so I hope that gives you an idea as to how that works. But I mean, this is sort of the basic concept. You can obviously add, um, you know, many more of these um, elements or settings to pause slides or animated figures at different uh, points or different frames for X number of frames. So check this videos if you'd like to learn more about Explain Your Video Creator 2.0 Pro. And if you've got any questions, uh, you know, feel free to uh, leave them in the comment section. Uh, if you want any specific videos to be created in terms of uh, Explain Dio, just let me know. And uh, I will uh, definitely do my best. Thanks for stopping by.